Documents Volume 3 of the Joseph Smith Papers covers the interesting and, and complex 14 months from February 1833 to March of 1834. Part of what the uh, reader would find in, in Documents Volume 3 are letters to and from uh, Joseph Smith in, in Kirtland as the church is growing and, and expanding in, in Missouri. And, and even in Kirtland and in other places in the United States. And one of the, the places that a church branch had grown up recently in late 1832 was uh, in Benson, Vermont. And John Sims Carter was a leader of the, the church branch there. He's a brother of Jared Carter and Gideon Carter. And, and he uh, was experiencing some, some difficult situations that he wasn't sure how to deal with in, in the early spring of 1833. And one of those was uh, the claims from a member of the church there named Jane Sherwood, who claimed to have received a vision that uh, directed the affairs of the church branch in that place. Uh, and so he wrote to his brother Jared, trying to get some, some insight, how do, how do I deal with this situation? You know, do I follow her lead um, or what do I do? And so Jared took it to Joseph Smith to have him respond to it. And, and Joseph Smith and Frederick G. Williams wrote a letter back to John Sims Carter with some counsel and instruction. I will inform you that it is contrary to the economy of God for any member of the church or anyone to receive instruction for those in authority higher than themselves. Therefore, you will see the impropriety of giving heed to them. But if any have a vision or a visitation from a heavenly messenger, it must be for their own benefit and instruction. For the fundamental principles, government, and doctrine of the church is invested in the keys of the kingdom.